Welcome back, travelers. Today, I'm gonna to teach you a trick about Priceline's Express Deals on their website, how to use it, but also know exactly what hotel you're going to get so you can save a ton of money and still enjoy your trip. So now you've seen a lot of my videos are about Airbnb and though I choose to use Airbnb mostly, sometimes it's just not available at the price I like. So let's get right to it. This is how when I travel to Houston, Chicago, Dallas, I get four and five star hotels for 50 to $70 a night and it's wonderful. So there's three things you need to look for when using Priceline. When you first load a screen, you're gonna notice that it's got all these hotels and it's gonna say mobile deal. It's normally $140 and they put a line through it and say it's only 105 or it's only 80 right so you want to look at that $140 because that's the original price you're gonna look at what its five star rating is like if it's a 3.5 4 star 4.5 star and then you're gonna look at what the user reviews are 7.5 out of 10 or 8 out of 10 so I'm in Wisconsin for my sister's wedding so I'm gonna use the hotel that she's staying in as the example so I did this at the Godfrey Hotel in Houston I mean Chicago three nights ago but here she's staying at a place with like a with a resort like a like a swimming pool and everything and she wants to do her wedding here so so I needed to find this hotel, but not for $160 like she's getting, I found it for $55. All right, so here's how I did it. When you look at the screencast I'm about to post up, you're gonna see that the Country Springs Hotel is a 2.5 star hotel with a user rating of 7.6 and the price of $129. Right below it, you see that there's an express deal. This makes it super easy to show you. It shows that there's a 2.5 star hotel with a user rating of seven or plus and the total price of 55 or 56 dollars and you're saving 56 percent. So what can we learn from this? The user rating of seven plus means it's between seven and 7.9. If it's eight or six or 9.5 it won't show up and it's only a 2.5 star hotel. So you can remove all the three star hotels, you can remove all the four star hotels. All the hotels that are 2.5 star with a rating of eight or better or 6.9 or lower won't show up either, right? So we know those two. Now there's still a few hotels with these ratings. So how do we find if the Country Springs Hotel is the one that we're about to get? It's the price. So you see that 55 or $56 is 56% off. That means that the $55 or $56 is 44% of the final price. So what we do is we divide that number by 44 and then multiply it by 100. That's how you get back to the 100% price. And you'll see that's between like $125 or $130. Well, so is the Country Springs Hotel. This is the only hotel that has a similar price to that reverse engineered final price. So now that we know that out of the three that are left, Country Springs is the only one at that price point. So when we book it, we can confidently say we've got the right hotel. And I actually booked it and I was correct. So I'm gonna like load some screenshots now of, the, of, our, of our victory that we had. So now you can use this other places. I do this in Dallas all the time or Fort Worth or Houston. And the cool thing about it is once you find that hotel, next time you go on to Express Deals, uh, Priceline will say, hint, you've booked this place before. So now you know exactly what hotel you're getting and you don't have to do all this math. Um, you don't have to do all this guesswork. So use this tip when you're traveling. If you can't find an Airbnb property that's at your price point and you're price sensitive, then Priceline uh, Express Deals, and that's how you figure it out. So enjoy your trips, travel safely. I will see you on the other side.